What's up guys, it's Tila here, and we are back with yet another episode of Fire Emblem 8 Randomized. And on this one, we will be tackling Chapter 20, which is titled, Darkling Woods. And in between last chapter and this one, I managed to level up a couple of our units, um, who I felt were lagging behind, and some of the other units as well, just because I felt like on the previous chapter in Ralston, we were having a rough go. Um, we didn't lose any units, however, I feel that is only because we were able to end the chapter uh, in a quick and efficient manner. So, I'm not gonna lie, I'm a little bit worried about the final <laughs> chapter. Uh, my units aren't, like, incredible. Some of them are pretty good, but they're not very tanky, and so on. So... We're just gonna have to see how it goes, right? I guess let's just jump right into it and head to the Black Temple. According to legend, the sacred stones have sealed evil away from the world. Four of the five stones have been destroyed, leaving only the last stone intact. The last stone must be protected to stave off the Demon King's restoration. Joshua and company challenged the demons of Darkling Woods. According to legend, the original possessors of the Sacred Stones defeated the Demon King in Darkling Woods. His foul blood seeped into the land, corrupting every seed and every root. The once pristine forest was transformed by the flood of disease and venom. Legend says the Demon King's corpse lies there still, not dead, but dreaming. Dreaming of when the last stone is crushed, and he will rise from his bed of rocks and worms and return to the surface. Deep within Darkling Woods, misshapen beasts roam in ever-growing numbers. As if answering some unheard call. Mm. <clears throat> the time grows near. Hold. Ha. Huh. What are you doing here, human? You should return to your own kind. This is no place for you to tread. This is darkness's domain. This is desecrated land. That's why I've come. I have the power of the Demon King. I will save us all. You. Evil grips your heart. No, you've given your heart to evil. What a tragedy. Human flesh cannot contain the demon. It cannot control it. You think yourself safe, but already your control slips. I see the madness eating at you. I see the beginning of the end. You're wrong. This... <laughs> I do this of my own will. I will save Grado's people. I had a vision. I saw my life traveling two roads. Down one, the Demon King conquers both my body and soul. Down the other, I master the Demon King. And with that power, I... <coughs> with that power, I avert disaster. I gave the people a better future. I resist the Demon King's attempts to wrest away my will. I saw this, and I made a decision. I walk the second road. You fool. The Demon King has blinded you to his true wish. How can you not see it? He's had you since the moment first you held the Darkstone. He has been hiding within you, luring you deeper into the shadows of his heart. He commands you and remakes you to suit his dark design. You're wrong. You think yourself unchanged. You think yourself the master. <laughs> I see only more evidence that the Demon King commands you now. 
can you not sense? It's not true! I... <laughs> I will save everyone! Think back. Remember. Are you truly the man you used to be? Would you justify war and murder to bring about peace and justice? Remember who you were and tell me if you are still yourself. But <laughs> All of this matters not. I know the Demon King has claimed me. It is not important. Not if I can save the world. My own soul is irrelevant. It is as if I feared. You will not give up this madness. I am Morva, the Dragon Kid who guards the entrance to these woods. I do not have the ability to save you. All I can do is destroy that demon that coils around your heart. To prevent the further damnation of your soul, I can only grant you eternal sleep. I cannot sleep. I have not. Not yet. There is no taboo I will not break. No sacrifice I will not make. I... You are beyond reason. Therefore, I too must do what I was born to do. As it was in that ancient battle, you will die here, Demon King. This awful darkness. I know, I can feel it too. This is Darkling Woods. It was here the heroes met the Demon King, and with the Sacred Stones, defeated him. I've heard the lingering energies of that battle are the source of the monsters. But I never imagined it would be as bad as this. It's worse than before. It's grown so much stronger. Simply standing here is a struggle. But we don't need to worry. My father's here. He'll take care of everything. Your father? Over there. On the other side of that swamp is the Black Temple of the Demon King. My father stands guard near it. This is where my father and I have lived for as long as I can remember. I see. So, this forest is like a home to you. Uh-huh. My foster father leads the Dragon Tribe. In the last Great War, both of my true parents were killed. Morva took me in and raised me as though I were his own child. So that's how you came to live here. My father holds back the monsters that are born in Darkling Woods. He's so strong and so very gentle. One day, I hope to be like him. Oh! Mer, what is it? Princess Garcia, Prince Joshua, we're under attack. A horde of those foul beasts is headed straight for us. Mer, are you well? If you're ill, we should get you too. No, no, it's nothing. I'll fight with you. I'll fight and we'll drive back the dark children. Nice. <laughs> Reeve, I'm leaving this to you. <laughs> As you wish. Please proceed with the rites of resurrection, sire. Okay. Oh boy. So, Joshua, Dussel, Renick, Gilliam, Cyrene, Galen. I don't know about. Like, Colm, Ross, Larchel, Innes. Ford, Mer, Luke, and Erica. See, they let us take all these units, and honestly, I don't have that many good units. <laughs> I mean, I can take people like this, but they're just kind of going to die, you know? Like, there's no way they're going to prove to be useful against something like this, right? Like, they're absolutely just gonna die. I guess I can take them as meat shields. Maybe they'll soak, like, a... A stone or something? Maybe? Uh, anyway. Uh, who will I take, then? I guess Seth? So, what can we give Seth? Sethy boy. Let's give him a shadow killer. Oh, he can't use any of these? Why? Why? He- Oh, he's a great lord. Okay, yeah, yeah. I, that makes sense. 
Uh, Iron Blade, sure. Let's give him like a generic weapon. No, he already has Shadow Killer, he doesn't need one. Um, okay. All these like really heavy swords. And a Vulnerale. Uh, sure, I guess. Are there any better weapons I can give her? Oh yeah, look at that. Brave Axe. Screw the Vulnerary, we're going all in on offense. Uh, Sword Reaver, love it. This Hammer has two, we'll get rid of it. Uh, let's go with the Killer Axe, and let's go with the Tomahawk. Love it. I love it. I would love for her to have Nosferatu, but... Kind of love to have Restore on hand. Um... Well, I could drop the elixir here and have Cyrene carry the restore. I suppose that would work. Whoops. Dazzle has restore. Okay, we have two people with restore. So, loot can get away with using Nosferatu here. Those eclipse tomes, man. I should just sell them, huh? They're not really doing me any good. All this stuff looks pretty good. Do I have, like, another short spear for Dussel? Whoops. Nope. Okay, jabby it is. <clears throat> I don't know. This stuff all looks pretty good. Uh, I mean, I'm gonna do the best I can here. Thunder... I would like Cyrene to have thunder, I think, instead of fire. Yeah. Um, Sale doesn't need Vulnerers, let's give him this Elixir. And then I had a spare Elixir as well. Let's just make sure we're carrying those instead of Vulnerers where possible. Okay. Okay. And... So normally what I like to do is send my flyers off in this direction and start picking off some of this gunk. Um, but I'm a little bit worried. Yeah. I don't see any shadow shot, though. Which is normally the reason why I do it, because I'm getting rid of those snipers. But no shadow shot means we have less to worry about, for sure. Of course, we have Reeve here, who is more beefy than he was even last chapter. And then we have Morva, which of course is always terrifying. Leader of the Maniki tribe. He was turned into a Draco zombie by Leon. Hmm. Yeah. Yep. And that's a thing. Okay. These guys have lethal talon. We're getting a lethal talon, huh? Okay. Well, we can keep. Uh... We can keep our flyers on the edge at least, like over here, and then. You're definitely going to be back here, healer. The flyers, of course, will keep kind of clustered like so. Fly a core. He's, this is like a really weak unit. <laughs> Seth. Oh man, oh man, oh man. Okay, I guess. Let's save and get right into it. Okay. So, first things first, we're uh, going to be pulling this here Gorgon. It does hit very hard. Killer Bow. Not a fan of that. 
Also, he hits pretty hard. Two killer bows! Happy fun time. Spirit and uh, wind sword. So, we can pull this guy here and the Gorgon here. Okay. Who do I want to do the pulling? Uh, she does hit pretty hard. 38, she has 11 speed. That's not that scary. Joshua is more than capable of yoinking this unit. For sure. Without dying, anyway. Let's go ahead with the short spear. And then, um... Loot can throw a summon down here. Huh? And then we can yoink this guy as well. Hopefully, anyway. She might just go for him. But... What can you do? I want to stay out of range. Larshell actually would have been a great unit to pull as well. Whatever. I just want to stay out of range with some of my really poor res units. Like Rossi Boy. Whatever. Cyrene can go there. It's there. It's gonna this is definitely gonna be a bottleneck, like <laughs> there's no way around it. Uh-huh. Uh who would I want to dance? I don't think I really want to. I guess I could like dance in us a little bit closer. He's a decent melee fighter. Something like that. Uh, so do I want to send my flyers in? These guys do not tremendously terrible damage, especially not against Burr. But I want to preserve for Dragonstone for next chapter. I really do. I feel pretty strongly about that. He does have Vidofnir. Good old monster slain. Uh, yeah, I'm, I think he can handle this. These are bow users, so well, one of them is. Um, I could give him the Philly shield. Yeah, I think that's the, yeah, that's probably a good idea. Let's go ahead and do that now. Do so can have heavy lance. Let's get some monster slaying going. Ooh, Pierce. Okay. Double Pierce. Damn. Lethal Glen. Okay. <laughs> we get a. Lethal Talon. We can give that to Murr, actually. Um, she does have a Poison Claw. That thing kind of sucks, I'm not going to lie. Uh, that's a turn, I suppose. <laughs> soon. Soon. It happens soon. The Demon King will be restored to his former glory. And I, his faithful servant, will bask in his radiant power. Then, oh, then I will have my revenge on those who scorned me. The Demon King has created for me a fine weapon, a Draco zombie. This fierce beast and I will guard the Black Temple's entrance. As long as we stand watch, no one will interrupt his rituals. We will drown all who dare approach in his virulent mud. <laughs> what a crazy man. Yo, Coot! Nice. 
That guy can't even touch Glenn, dude. So good. Let's go. Oh, that's scary. Come on, dodge. Ooh, yes. It's fine, dude. Glenn's just baiting him out, right? Totally according to plan. I don't care about that. We are kind of using this weapon a little bit here in this turn. But I like the idea of kind of clearing out this path forward. That's totally fine. Would have loved to pierce there. But that will have to do. And again, as long as we don't break these weapons, we can have them repaired. And I did explain why. Of course, the Phantom's getting pulled by old Gorgon. Old Snakehead. Sorry, bro. I got the Philly Shield. Mm -hmm. Okay. Can you do anything? Yeah, you can kill that, kind of, maybe. Uh, maybe. It's gonna be really close. Um, if I could do, like, if I could get a crit, it, it could happen. Okay, this guy doesn't have a dragon spear or anything like that. With Sale, this is totally doable. Right? No, not really. It does, it's a low percentage chance he kills. Okay, well, let's go for it. Damn. You had one job, Dussel. You had one job! Oh well. This guy is kind of beefy. Uh, uh, yeah, I mean, he can attack into Glenn, I guess. What does this look like without Vidofnir? 12, uh, okay. It's not beautiful, but it's workable. Basically, I need to kill this right now. Okay, that'll do. Toxin, eh. I'm not really worried about that. This is annoying, man. I wish I could get a kill here, but it's not gonna happen, so. Uh I could do this. If I if I miss though, then this guy's picking off a flyer. So I have to use the Dragonstone. So it goes. And, uh, old Sally here is kind of worthless at this point. I wish I could say that weren't true, but... Mm, Erica can actually... get a kill here. It could happen. Oh, man. Oh, it's not pretty. Should we go for it? Ah, uh, I don't know. I don't know about that. This is probably better. I would rather use this, though, on something else. Um... 19 hit. Yeah. This is pretty good. Low percentage chance I get a hit here. Demon Surge is a pretty cool looking spell. Nice, of course he nails it. What? No, dude! No, 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 no. Wow. Are you kidding me? I... 
I don't even know what to say about that. I'm floored. Absolutely flabbergasted by that. Okay. Well, gotta recover. Uh, can I kill this guy? Yeah, easily. Unfortunately, no animations for Joshua when he's using axes. Already described why. Sirene needs to try and... Yeah... She can kill this big guy. Okay. Okay, that's good. Now, I need to get rid of this guy for sure. Please crit. Please. Try again. Nobody's critting. Okay. Nobody on my squad is able of crit, apparently. Uh, okay. Well, I guess that means Ross is gonna... 79. Can I do better than that? Yeah, we can do better. Here we go. Okay. So Renick secures the kill there. And, uh, yeah, excellent. So now what we can do... This guy, of course, it's really hard, but... Um, loot can definitely kill him. I'd prefer not to have to rely on leap near to do it, but I'm willing to do it. Just to kind of clear this path out. Nice. Of course you crit now when I don't need it. Goodbye, Colossus Cyclops. Okay. We can pull this guy out. 26 damage. I take a hit. Uh, he has 14 speed. Uh, I am really slow. Uh, it's going to kind of be pound for pound, but it's fine. We can bait him out over here. We're out of range of these Gorgons. And they don't have demon... Uh, excuse me. They don't have stone or anything. So... Should be fine. No, dude. There we go. Um, I need to heal up. Whole Innis. After that last engage. Really pitiful. Gillian levels up. Okay. Not too bad. Getting that skill up, which is like a horribly sore spot for him. Um, yeah, I'm not going to dance anybody up quite yet. Kind of like where we are at in the moment. Here they come, surging forward to attack. Dodge! Nice. Dude. Critting on attack number two doesn't do anything, bro. It's just a flourish. It's just a T-pose. Glenn, unfortunately, has very poor resistance, so it's good he dodged there. <sighs> really? Okay. Sure. I, I thought he was going to grab the forest tile. Okay. 
Sure thing there, champ. Okay, Innis, want to try again, buddy? 50% crit here. Nope, can't stick it. Can you at least dodge? Okay. Well, we're certainly not being efficient with our weapons, are we? I like this. Let's go for it. Nice. Good job, Ross. Um, bum, 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 bum. Yeah, this is good. So, these guys are coming. Uh, these two are going to be able to reach us. Halbert is nightmarish. Hammer. So, gotta get rid of Joshua here. Who can. There we go. Okay. So, definitely don't want this guy attacking <laughs> one of my. Uh, one of my boys on horses. Something like that's fine. Yipperoo. Okay. Siren can go like meow. Comb kind of sucks. Guess we can put him over here. Just trying to create some surface area for my units. Okay. Sure. Now, this is where the real battle's going on. Glenn has got a lot to contend with here. That's, of course, scary. Um, any other dragon spears? Killer, killer, dragon. No. Okay. So, unfortunately, we're going to be relying on Murr some more here. She has to kill this Dragon Spear. That is a primary threat. And look at that. Big crit. Okay. Um, Rez is a sore spot for Glenn, so we're going to be killing this here Evil Eye. Focusing it down. Yikes. That's not bad. Uh, but I don't think I'll engage. However, I am comfortable keeping him in range, I think. It, they have really poor percentage chance to hit him. So... Uh, yeah... Yeah, I think this is good. I won't initiate. Okay. That's a turn. Here they come. Good kill by Diesel. One more charge left on this Lance Reaver. They are going for him. Miss. Nice. Okay, good enough. He's soaking, at the very least. Uh-huh. That's fine. Ooh, there we go, finally. Love it. Dodged, get wrecked. Uh huh. Nice. Can you get a kill in this? Dog, you got a 67% chance to crit, man. Are you like the worst sword master of all time? How are you missing all of these crits, bro?
this is fine. Ross can add another kill to his list. Eh, that's kind of useless. At this state in the game. Oh, that's interesting. Yeah, okay. Let's go for it. Nice. Got him. Ephraim the Assassin, huh? <laughs> nice. Okay, Lara Shell can handle this. That's for sure. And a crit as well. Love it. Gets the K. Okay, we got a big boy and some halberds here. Definitely need to get her out of there. Or I could just, you know, like move here. I suppose. Can they reach the weeds there? Yup, of course they can. Wonderful. How far can I dance? I could dance up to the weeds. Okay. Well, let's get the kill here. Got to. trying to maximize my distance. There we go. So these two are out of range. Mm -hmm. Then we can dance up Cyrene. Now, yeah, there's a lot of stuff over here. Dragon Axe, more Hallbirds, of course. Oh my god. Oh, it's so shit. can't even move here to attack with Cyrene to knock one out because there will be one, two, I guess one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, yeah. There will be three halberds coming at her. That is nightmarish. The thing of nightmares. So need to move her back. Uh or yeah, okay, I can rescue. That's great. I do want to pull them down. At the very least. I don't want them to just sit there. So putting the phantom there is what we will do. And uh, anybody need a heal? Nah. We Gucci. Okay. Now, kind of scary. But, uh, hmm. I, mean, I can keep using this weapon, but he's going to use it up very quickly. Okay, we got a dragon spear here as well. Um. Okay, I'm gonna do it. Nice, love it, dude. So does he die? Uh, no. If he gets crit, he does not die. But he's gonna be in really bad shape. So hopefully that doesn't happen. Okay, it doesn't. Good job. Mm -hmm. So these guys are just like spawning all 
day long. He's got a Dragon Slayer. I don't want him to be able to initiate on me like that. That's going to be a turn. Uh-huh. Dodge, please. Nope. Alright, at least we retaliate with a crit. put him in the forest hoping that would preserve his life but not gonna quite cut it there more reinforcements as is predictable dragon spear is scary scary stuff so we're gonna rely on Mur to just one round this pool Uh, I don't know about... The boss, I think he does usually move. I mean, the Draco zombie doesn't, but I think Reeve will. Uh, I don't remember, though, if that's true. I am terrified of finding out. <laughs> the hard way. Oh, goodness. Um, we can probably range him down. Oh, yeah. Nice. That's what we were looking for. See, Pierce is awesome. Yeah. There we go. And a level 4 Dusel. Pretty decent. Getting more HP and defense. See, he finally has grown into a real boy. Look at that. He can finally take some hits. Pretty unlucky, though. The crits are not in his favor. Okay. We have a situation here. All birds coming up the path. And, uh, Dragon Spear, Horse Slayer. Yep, so basically all horse users get wrecked. You're not doing anything. And, hey, the bulk of my units are horse users. Hooray! That wasn't my choice, by the way. I like paladins, okay? But, um, <laughs> I, ha I got, like, you guys saw it. I got so many recruits and all, they were all already leveled once. So I had to pick Paladin. It's like that or Recruit. I'm not picking Recruit or Paladin. Are you kidding me? Okay, Ephraim. Ephraim gets a level. Let's go. Level three. Not fantastic. Honest. Innis is pretty good against these halberd users, anyway. Look at that. They can't really hit him. He needs to crit if he wants to actually do something, though. Come on, dude. Please. Please. What is going on with you? What is, what is happening? Tell me. What's happening? I don't understand. I can pretty reliably tank these guys with my healer. And he has monster weapon effectiveness with light magic, which is pretty sweet. Gets a crit there. Good job, Gilliam. Gonna have to rely on non-horsed units for the immediate future. Um, okay. Uh, let us go ahead and plop down the summon. And, uh, 
Let's dance up Ennis. I want to get him into a forest tile as he engages what's up a here. Finally, you crit. Thank you, bro. Thank you. Just shake it off and get back to work. There you go. See? All is right in the world. Okay. Let's go ahead and just put this guy here in some thickets. That doesn't really do much, but it's fine. And he'll bait out Dragon Spear or Short Spear or something. Um. I don't really want these horse users <laughs> anywhere near what's coming. So, I guess this is fine. Sure. Okay. And that's going to be a turn. Uh-huh. Love that. Yeah, Innis is super dodgy, that's great. There you go, you're back, baby. He's back. Gets the kill. Yeah, we don't need that, Garbo. Mm hmm. Bring it. That will have to do, I guess. In his levels. Okay. Strength HP, luck. Not too shabby, I suppose. He's already pretty speedy. Pretty dodgy. Nice kill there. And there they get the kill on the Phantom. Swordmaster in Forest Tile is really hard to hit. Tis that natural environment. Nice. Oh, hell yeah, dude. Put him in his place. Yep. Mm -hmm. Oh, great. Endless reinforcements. And of course, we got a dragon spear here. Yep. Okay. Well, what do they have? Okay. That means I'm just gonna back up. Uh, Dusel needs to heal anyway. Yeah, it's one, two, three, four, five, six, seven. So yeah, he's fine here. Okay. Gonna use the Alexa. Try and top us off here. Nice. We got a lot of bullshit coming from up here. Uh, horse slayers all day. Okay, Ephraim on a forest tile is gonna be pretty decent. Nice. 
man, oh man. It's not quite good enough. That is, but the chances of me getting a kill are kind of slim. Guess I'll try for the crit. No. I'm just gonna try and get lucky here. It's not that lucky. But too lucky for me. Uh. Whatever. Might as well just use what's left of this killing edge. Erica is complete garbage. If I throw her up here, she's going to definitely get killed. Uh, more slayers. Halberds, horse slayers. They just counter me all day long. I can use Ivaldi and get a kill here, I guess. I hate to waste this weapon. Two charges on a generic monster like this. That will do. Uh, let's. He's got a dragon spear. He's so close to dying. I would hate to waste loot on this. There we go. I don't actually care if Erica dies, so. Might as well try and get a kill out of her. Alright, Dazla. Let's, let's go for it, buddy. There you go. Good job, man. Oh, Dazla, look at this guy. <laughs> Promoted at level 20 mage. Isn't that impressive? Unbelievable. I don't care about the dragon spear, I care about this whole nonsense um, but my horse units are mostly in the clear to start moving in this direction so that's what I'll do I'm gonna equip ranged weapons on them because these evil eyes are probably gonna start targeting them man Pop a summon down here. I would love to be able to kill this punk. It's probably not gonna happen though. Oh, I get it. Nice, dude. It's actually really useful. Cool. Okay, we can start getting all these guys over here. Dragon Spear, Silver Spear, and a Killer Bow, Killer Bow, Halberd, of course. Eh, he can't really reach me this turn, though. So, something like that's fine. Uh huh. Nice dodge, Phantom. With the killer axe, which is 
a very good phantom. Oh, get out of here, dude. Nonsense. <laughs> Alright. This is where having a flying unit is actually really nice. Over here, because we can pick off one of these dudes. Uh, I do have, um... I do have Purge. I could try and take him out that way. Mm-hmm. I'm gonna kill this one. The Horse Slayer. I'm gonna go for it. Come on, buddy. Hell yeah. Awesome. So that is the primary threat, to be honest. I mean, these guys are super annoying, but... If we can claim these forest tiles, this will become more manageable. Weapon triangle advantage against most of them with the Lance Reaver. And, uh... Just gotta worry about... Where was he? Halberd here. So, Halberd needs to die, and then we can... Move in with the rest of our units, I suppose. What we can do temporarily is put a Phantom here, I suppose. Weapon triangle advantage here, like so. Um, let's get a javelin out like that. Rennet can come up. Um, yeah. He has decent defense. So he can kind of come in with a silver lance there. Dazla, hmm. Ephraim needs to move here. Uh, I really don't want Colm. In the open like that. So, let's put you here, I guess. Siren can go way up here. For the thunder. And Dazla can heal up. Good old Ephraim. Mm -hmm. Let's go ahead and drop a save. We haven't actually done that yet. It's probably a good idea. So, Dragon Spear needs to be one rounded by Myrrh. We've already seen this happen multiple times. It needs to keep happening because they are so dangerous. Mm hmm. I gotta say, this whole improved monster weapons thing is a massive pain in the ass. It's like so annoying, dude. <laughs> it's such a pain in the ass. Oh, God. Alright. Gotta take some risks. Can't be wasting my best weapon constantly. There we go. Um, and then, of course, I'm still worried about Reeve, so... What is... Oh God, what does this look like? Yeah, I do survive if I get crit, so... I suppose... Sally will die if he gets hit by that. <laughs> he will absolutely die. 
Okay. Uh, I don't know if that was a good idea. That was really dumb, actually. She's gonna die. Uh, 89. Okay. She's not gonna die, right? It's gonna be painful, but she's not gonna die. I think. Okay, well, let's go for it. Good chip. Got the kill. Nice. Kills the phantom. Sad day. No crit. That's good. Good dodge as well. Mm -hmm. Alright. And a kill. Love to see it. try, I guess. Yeah. Ooh. Good dodge. Oh, there's Captain America, dude. Uh, okay. Yeah, let's get rid of this halberd, dude. That flyer is not moving. I'm getting so tired of these guys, man. This endless barrage of dragon spears and killer lances. It's uh, pretty annoying. So, one, two, three, four, five, six, seven. Yeah, so we just back up again, I guess. Um, I'm gonna take this vulnerary and heal up a little bit actually seems like a solid business move there okay Erica can you kill this eye for me I would be so appreciative thank you lass thank you very much okay We're doing all right. Um, we can kill this halberd guy like so. Yeah, that eliminates that threat to the bulk of my army, to be completely honest. And we'll just kind of scout for what's left. Yep, 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 uh, Dragon Spear, Killer Bow, okay. Uh, yeah, yeah, yeah. No Halberd here, either. I mean, this stuff is scary, for sure, but it's not, like, effective damage, which is, you know, <laughs> it's like worst-case scenario. So... Wish I could say you were useful. Ay ay ay. Let's try and get some damage in. There we go. Should be a kill. Mm-hmm. Nice. Renick showing them how it's done. Gets a level as well. Okay. Decent HP strength could be better. I mean, we still could use a little more defense and stuff. Well, I'll take it. Uh, I need someone to move in here and range down this fool. Loot's a decent candidate for it. Sirene might be even better. Yeah. Nice dodge. Big crit as well. Get it. Yeah! 
Uh-huh. Okay. Now, Yeshua can move in here and kill this pretty convincingly. Oh, yeah. Uh, Lars Shell, can you kill this? Oh, yeah. Right on the money. Never mind, that was a crit. <laughs> no complaints here. In this, you can put in some damage on this for sure. Might not get the kill, but if we use Odd Holma, you would. That does increase the chance you will be hit, however. Alright, nothing ventured, nothing gained. Let's try and get rid of them. Good dodge, good kill. Well done. Okay, working our way through this mess. Let's throw down a summon. Put it in the forest tile, get a little bit of chip damage done there. Not a lot, but it is something. The rest of these units are just gonna kinda be stuck back here, I think. I mean, I could have, I suppose I could have danced up Ephraim. Whatever. It's gonna be a turn. A little bit worried about the killer bows, but what can you do? Yeah, this is fine. Totally fine. Would have enjoyed a kill there, but it is what it is. Uh huh. See? Forest tile, super useful. Good dodge by loot there. And she should be able to navigate a kill here pretty easily. Really close to a level for her as well. Amazing. So good. That that's bait right there. That's bait. As is that. Swordmaster on the forest tile. Good luck. Not gonna happen. Okay. Here we go again. Kill the dragon spear with Myrrh. and get some chip on this guy. Oh, there we go. Good kill, Glenn. That's amazing. Okay. And Dusel can finish off this guy as well with the less useful heavy spear. Okay. Hopefully we're done with those flyer reinforcements. I grow tired of them. Uh, this is possible. I'll go for it, I guess. Psst. Okay, bro. If you say so. Go kill a bow. This is actually not bad. Yeah. Let's do it. Ross gets a kill here. Pretty sweet. Love the crit. Okay. Uh, well, let's just move 
Venice here to the forest tile. Eh, that's not quite good enough. Eh, we'll just use Automa. Whatever. See, that chip damage allowed that to be a one round kill. See, everything is, everything is worth it. Every little bit. Let's go for this. That one gets a pretty easy kill there. Um, what do we got? Spear, short spear. Eh. Okay, yeah, yeah. If I create a summon right now, loot will level, and then I mean it's not very good. But okay, that skill or that magic caps her. Unfortunately, she's still lagging in skill defense pretty hard. But we can do something like this. Put this on the forest tile. Like so. Mm, I really don't want to concede the forest. Brannock has pretty decent defense, so we can put him like here. And we're not conceding the forest in doing so. Uh, Larshell is actually not very tanky, so I don't necessarily want her on the front line. So I think we'll, um, do something like this, where she's behind with the javelin. And Siren can go there, and then we can dance up loot. And we can get her, actually forest tile, which makes her survivability go up pretty good. Yeah. Stick with old Flux here. Great. Love the dodge. And we get the kill. Simple as that. speed on Seth here. I mean, he could definitely bait out a shot from an archer or something. Soak is so important when you're playing a game like this. Like, Try and just mitigate as much damage as possible on your core units. So if we can bait them into attacking a unit we're not really using right now, like Seth, that's a win. Especially if he doesn't die. <laughs> So, um, yeah, that's going to be a turn. Goes for the Phantom, gets the kill, unfortunately. Okay, they're going for Innis. Good luck. Damn. This is really going to cost us two charges of Odholma. Are you serious? Uh, okay. Amazing dodge by Colm. Mm. Yeah, they're not taking the bait, really. Well, they might. I don't know. Okay, they are. Cool. Great. Love it. And there are the reinforcements. Gilliam should be able to kill this. If not, he should be able to at least get decent chip damage. Yep. Looks good. Unfortunately, these guys are in the mountains at the moment, so we can't really do anything about that. Can't chase them. Ephra might be able to get a kill here. We'll go for it. Oh yeah, silencer. See ya. One of the coolest crit animations, in my opinion. Trash level. Absolute garbage. 
hate it. Okay. Terrified about that. Not gonna lie. <laughs> oh man. Oh man. 24 speed. 35 attack. Uh, loot has to be the one to pull in. It's gonna be weapon triangle disadvantage. I will! Siren could probably do it. Yeah. Yeah, she could do it. And that would give her advantage against him. Instead. Instead of Ruski's. Uh. Yeah, that's fine. Right on the money here. Hellfire. Oh, that is actually useful. Um, but I, I mean, maybe... Eh, for next chapter, yeah. We can always merge it later. So, Spoder skitters towards her. She has um, 101 avoid with the forest. So, this thing is not hitting her. Not likely, anyway. Or one off from being able to pull Reeve there. I guess this is fine. I really need to save these weapons, though, for the last chapter. So... I don't want to go below 20 if possible. Okay. Useful stuff. Uh, I don't care if I pull this spider here with loot. She's pretty good avoid as well. I don't want to attack them here. I do want to bait them down. So. I suppose there's fine. This thing is pretty spooky. 38 damage there. Okay. Yeah, this is actually a little bit scary. So when I put her up into harm's reach, she'll take 10. I mean, she won't die, but she will be taking shots from this and this if Reeve decides to move, which... Uh... I have a feeling he might, so... I don't know why I'm doing this, but... I'm doing it. Experience for Dazla, I suppose. I don't want to move my dancer any closer to any of this. I suppose Dazla can be danced up... Um, and into the forest tile. That should be fine. Yeah. Kind of provides a buffer here. Uh, yeah, I don't really want to move anybody much closer than they are. I guess I can move him up one. Eric can move up there. Okay. Don't want to pull this guy. You have a uh, steel bow. Fun. Just try and kill him. Alright. Alrighty. So, what do these guys have? Killer bow, huh? Fun stuff. 
Well, I can't move in Dusel. Okay, he'll come up with the killer bow here. Dusel can go here. That will be a turn, I suppose. Mm-hmm. Pretty poor chance to hit. Nice. Not gonna quite get a kill here, but it will be good chip damage on the spoder. Unfortunately, he's in the forest tile as well. Makes it kind of hard to hit him. But we do twice. Nice. Going for the phantom. Doesn't quite get the kill there. Nice dodge by Ross. Oof. Miss. Yeah, at least we get some chip damage. That's a W. Oh, okay. That's scary. Oof. Okay, we double. Should have seen that coming. Glenn has the Philly shield, so he shouldn't be killed by this archer. I do take out the phantom. And his dodges. Amazing. That actually would have been a kill if he crit. Oh god. <sighs> Granted, it, I would have been really unlucky for that sequence to happen. That would have been some BS. And you know it. 50% and then... Porp, what was the chance to hit of this guy? Then a 43%, and then a 24% check on that 43% to kill Glenn. That would have been some horse shit. They got two out of three. They got two out of three. But two out of three ain't gonna cut it. So I'm gonna heal up Glenn. I just wanna see what this looks like. It's not beautiful, but he can tank a couple of hits. Two spiders come in. 32, 32, yeah. He, he should be able to. Yeah. Um. They can't kill him. And they should miss. Like, honestly, one of them should at least. So, Deucel secures the kill on this killer bow, dude. Glenn is going to... Oh, gosh. Yeah, you have an elixir. Okay. Uh... No. Let's go, like, here. Give me that, please, and thank you. Well, the good news is we got rid of that demon surge monster before we had to engage the boss. That's pretty useful. Damn. I really don't want to use any more Odholma. I'd like to make use of him elsewhere. I guess this is fine. Fine. Go to Hammer. Don't need that. At least not right now. Let's go for the kill here. Josh gets it, no problem. That's not great. Ross can probably get a chip kill here. Eh. I'll go for it. Okay. It works out. Ross gets a level as well, and it's garbage. 
what can you do? Gilliam, can you do something here? Evaldi, oh, you're one off, bro. Dude, that sucks. Uh, I guess I can dance him. If I can chip here, I can maybe get a kill. Okay. Well, we get the DPS and we get the dodge. That's nice. <sighs> gonna put loot here so that she cannot be hit. And we're gonna go for some chip damage at a minimum. An old pokey boy. Alright, we get a kill as well. That's nice. Eh. Uh, this is a bit of a risky move, honestly. Seventy six percent chance. for it. Alright, we get it. Nice. It's It was risky because uh, um, I I think he would be able to kill my dancer. <laughs> That's scary. Okay. This guy is pretty much a goner. So Dazla should be able to finish him off with an Elfire Blast. And he does get a crit. Nice. Beautiful. And Dazla gets a level as well. Level 2 Sage. Look at that. Leveling up things, he levels up best. He's nothing if not kind of tanky, but he has really poor speed, so... In the end, not exactly tanky. So Cyrene should be able to engage here. Uh, she has 8 con, so she slowed down 2 with an Elfire. So that puts her at 23 speed. 15. Okay, she can actually double him. Because uh, he is a weak old, frail old man carrying a very heavy tome. With 29 res. Gosh. I'm not going to do much damage. But I got to pull him. So. And I won't be conceding forest. He will be. So, yep. <clears throat> let's, uh, let's see if he'll pull him. I want to stay out of range with all my other units. Uh, uh, yeah. So, this is fine. What do we got over here? Silver Lance, Silver Lance, Spear, Silver Lance. Lethal Talon. Meh. Yeah, okay. Brennett can go here. With Lay Killer Lance. Colm can go there. Ah, uh, well, you can go here or something. Okay. That's a turn. Spiders skittering forward as predicted. One already hits, which is super annoying. Decent chip damage there. Spider number two. Dodges. That's good. Alright, heavy spear broken. Yep. Made use of what was left of that. Here comes the boss. Ugh, your eyes annoy me. Why do you not despair? Why do you not surrender? Because I have the forest tile. See? Yep, doubling as predicted. And Cyrene levels. 
Not much to get for her these days. She does get HP, so that's nice. Uh, of course, we have reinforcements. They are apparently endless. Um, let's go ahead and take this guy out. Hopefully we dodge so we aren't poisoned. Nice. And we're going to pick up a lethal talon here. I could give that to Murr. I think I will. Yes, I think I will. Hmm, indubitably. I'm gonna go with the Silver Lance here to secure a kill. Okay, it's a crit. It doesn't matter. Nonetheless, another lethal talon. Mm-hmm. Okay, so Murr can take this lethal talon. And, um... Well, golly gee, the boss needs to die. And, uh... We're gonna definitely save before we do that. Yeah. So. Definitely saving... Before we jump into this. Um, because I have a terrible feeling that... <laughs> this guy's gonna... Uh, he's gonna crit me and I'm gonna die horribly. Um... This is pretty good chip damage. I hate to have to use more Excalibur, but I feel like I have to. If he crits Cyrene, she won't die, so we gotta wear him down a little bit, I think. Yep, see? He's critting. What a nightmare. Okay, we can get a kill there. I'd rather not use Odholma, so I'm gonna take a bit of a gamble here. Okay, it works out. Hannes gets a kill. <laughs> Even if you defeat me, you're too late to stop it. The one true demon will rise. Not a great level for Ennis, if I'm honest. Um, I like that. That's pretty good. At a minimum, some chip here. Oh, we get a kill. Good job, Gilliam. So, these guys do hit pretty hard, and for some reason they are not moving down. Maybe they will if I go here. Only one of them has a ranged weapon. Ross is pretty slow, but they shouldn't double him. Whatever. I'm gonna claim some forest tiles and, you know, they can attack whomever they wish, I suppose. I need to get my dancer away from these guys. That's one thing I know for sure. Okay. And this can... I don't know, dude. Come down here. Seth could use a heal. Sure. Dazla can heal him up. There we go. God, Erica. <laughs> oh, I'm a little bit worried. Uh, no, she's, she'll be okay. She'll be okay. Give her the tomahawk. YOLO. Uh. Okay. 
loot comes down here, pops a summon. I want to bait them down from this stupid mountain. So, the summon's the way to go with that. And that's a turn. Spider skitters forward. And Glenn dodges. Great. And then crits as well. Getting some sick chip damage there. The spider's almost dead. Boy, are they tanky, huh? Ate a crit and a regular hit from Glenn. Nice. Phantom dodges. Baits both of them down from the mountain. That is super useful. And we've got reinforcements once again for the 58th time so far on this map. Let's go ahead and clear this boy out with uh, old Joshua. We've got the Brave Axe here coming in handy. Real close to a level there. Can Gilliam secure a kill here? Mm, no. He could with this, maybe, but... I think I'd rather make use of what's left of the shine. Get some chip damage in. Okay, he does take a, a shot there, but that's fine. Gotta make use of our resources. And, um... I think Erica can finish him off. Yeah. Looks good. These guys are not pulling. I don't know what their script is. I'm not sure why they're not. But okay, sure. Cyrene can kill this guy with uh, Thunder. Pretty convincingly at that. Gets the crit on him. Okay, Dazzler down here, let's throw a summon down, uh, yeah I don't know what their script is, I'm gonna move Colm over here, I'm really gonna try and kill this guy if I can this turn. So, Innis, let's make use of this final Killing Edge charge. Gets the kill with it. A great use, if I do say so myself. And Renick. Well, Renick, we're not going to be moving closer to the boss than this. We can get a little bit of chip damage in on this guy. And by a little bit, a bit I mean a considerable amount. It's like 75% of his health. Working him down. And, um... Yeah, we can pull him with our Phantom as well. And then the following turn... We'll be in position to just one round all these reinforcements. Um, don't want to move Seth into like a kill range of this guy, necessarily. <laughs> Anybody need to heal? Cyrene does. Okay. Let's heal her up with old Dazla here. Pop out the men, because he doesn't have great magic. And I do want to full heal her. <clears throat> so. Glenn can finish off this spot. Eh, let's use a... Let's, uh, let, let's, let's use this weapon, yeah. Nice, okay. Dusel gets the kill. That's just fine. And, uh, I don't know. These guys are just kind of sitting, chilling. Glenn can move up over here. And so can Murr. Uh-huh. And Sala can go there, and that's a turn. Yep, as predicted, he's baited by the Phantom. Phantom can't quite get the kill, unfortunately. That's okay. Let's move Erica here. 
I mean, Gilliam could probably purge them down, but I mean, if they're not gonna move, then I don't really care. spawns. Can Colm get this kill? Yeah, not too hard for him. Get a little bit of experience on him. Nice dodge. Ephraim can get this kill as well. Right on the money with the Iron Blade. Great. Okay. This is, uh... This is usually what I do. Just have Mur kill the boss, because she has effectiveness against him. It'll be two Dragonstone charges. I think that's fine, honestly. Um, so let's go for it. Uh, I'm sorry. Plus, you know, it should be up to her to do this. Okay. Now, uh, need to dance up Joshua. Get him close to securing the throne. The throne. The, <laughs> the space. I guess. Ba -ba -bom, ba -ba -bom. So, this is the Black Temple. The Demon King is here. We have to stop him before he can begin the ritual. Let's waste no time, brother. Sira's going off. I'm sorry. Forgive me, father. Murr, where are you? Uh, Here you are. Murr, we were worried. Murr, are you crying? No, it's nothing. The poison in these woods is thick burns my eyes. Wait a minute. That dragon. Could he have been? Of course not. There's nothing wrong. After everything you have suffered, this is... I can't. This is nothing. Murr. Joshua. I'm so sorry. You kept silent this whole time, so as not to trouble us. Everything's fine, Joshua. I'm fine, see? I'm ready to... to... Let yourself cry. These are dark times. There's no reason for you to hide your sorrow. Joshua, I... 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 Wah! <laughs> She's crying. Father, father. Yeah. Sad day. Father! Hold on, please! Father! Leon, this is the end for me. From now on, you... Don't say that, Father. You must concern yourself with Grado. The people, our people, must be saved. Leon, tell me again. What will happen to Grado? I have seen it many, many times now. As have the court mages. 
It's the same every time, Father. It's always the same. Sometime in the coming years, the southern continent will collapse. Countless people will die instantly. Those who don't will likely starve. None but the mages and I know the vision, as you ordered. But if we don't do something, all of those people will die. Please tell me, Father. What should I do? What? Leon, when I die, you will be Emperor. The Emperor must protect his country. There is nothing more I can do. It's you. You must... You must protect our people. But, Father, I don't have the power. Uh, uh, Rene, if I ask Garcia and Joshua for help, I I'm sure they would... You would ask Rene to rescue us from a natural disaster? They would not help us. Grado's borders would overflow. It's starving refugees by the thousands. Rene would close her borders to us. It's only natural. Rene has a duty to protect herself. No, that would never. Leon, you are the one who must save our people. You must take my place. The citizens of Grado are counting on you. Father! No, wait! It, I cannot do anything without you, Father. Father. His Highness. I am... I am weak. Because I am weak, people will die. I... Prince Leon. Ephraim. I... Open the seal on the sacred stone of Grado. The sacred stone? But that's... You've seen the scrolls. You know there is a way to stop the coming disaster. If those scrolls are correct, the rites they describe can save all of Grado. But it will require a staggering amount of dark energy, and a sacrifice as well. The human body cannot contain the powers these rites demand. And yet... Of the five sacred stones, Grado's alone possesses a greater power. It is the very prison housing the soul of the ancient Demon King. If we could harness its power, well... If we can do that, we can avert disaster and save countless lives. But you forget... I forget nothing! I know I am too weak. Because of me, all of Grado will be destroyed. I need... I need the sacred stone. I must become stronger. I will become stronger. Everything is in readiness. What a weird way of saying that. The stones have been destroyed. The Demon's King's power swells. And the Black Temple possesses all the demonic energy I will need. The rites can begin. All that remains is for me to sacrifice my life. The disaster will be averted. My people will be saved. Alright guys, that's a wrap for this chapter. If you enjoyed this episode, make sure to give me a thumbs up. It helps the channel tremendously. And I appreciate all of your support as always. And I look forward to seeing you all on the next one. So until then, peace.